All right, lads. So today we're going to be reviewing Inform Javier Morales. Plays for Real Salt Lake in the MLS. He's five foot eight tall, right foot. He's got medium medium work rates, three star weak foot, and four star skills. Looking at his in games, he stands up to 87 vision, 85 curve, 84 stamina, 84 balance, and 83 short pass. We have also included all the upgrades over his non inform as a comparison for you. So you can see each individual stat upgrade there from all of his stats. So you can always pause it for a close look at any of them. So this is the team we used Inform Morales in, a 4 2 3 1 MLS team with Morales at CAM. So now onto the gameplay so you can see how he was performing for us. Now looking at his card stats, it does look pretty average to be honest. With that 82 passing, he's the only real standout stat on card. But on the pitch, he didn't feel too bad on the ball. Was decent enough dribbling wise, nothing special. But did he manage to go on some decent runs dribbling. And does have his 4 star skills to help him out along the way in that department as well. So decent skill wise. Pace did actually feel fine to me. Didn't struggle too much. But don't try and sprint your way through the defenders with Morales, he's not that fast, just try and make more of a use of his dribbling, use your skills dribble more, stop start dribbling is the best way to get through. He was actually good creatively as well, does have a good passing game, 81 long and 83 short and does have 87 vision on him as well, so he's good creatively, did grab a couple of assists for our team as well, so great passing game on him, that is probably his real uh, big positive is his passing game and in front of goal he was not that bad, especially in the box from range he was re struggling a bit but in the box he does only have 72 finishing but he did have a decent enough 80 shot power and was doing pretty good in front of goal for a cam one or two shots were straying a bit wide was missing the target now and again but overall was solid in front of goal and despite his poor heading start did manage to pop up with two headed finishes as well first one he was in the right place at the right time to get that header ax it over the keeper into the far corner so that was just an instance of his being in the right place to get that header and the second was a complete stroke of luck manages to get up heads the ball straight against the post comes back and hits Cesar's trailing arm to just bounce over the line so the FIFA gods really were smiling on Morales for that one uh, considering it was a 90th minute winner as well to rub salt into the wounds I did feel sorry for him he was playing really good and that goal is a, just a typical FIFA 90th minute goal was really really lucky with that header probably wouldn't have gone in any other day so now let's have a look at Inform Morales' performance stats. So in seven games, he did manage to bag six goals and get two assists. All of his stats are on the left there. His goal information on the right. Position map does show you where the goals were scored and his assists were created as well. So overall, we're giving Inform Morales an average 7.5 out of 10. Did do a decent job at camp for us, but he was only really average as a player. Uh, nothing really stood out with Morales. Is a good passer of the ball and does have his 4-star skills. That are his good points. But I never really thought to myself, this guy is good. Never really stood out. Wasn't Didn't have that magical moment to really love him. Probably coming from using all his team of the season players. We're coming back down to the uh, end of FIFA. We're struggling with to get decent informs but he's a decent option in the MLS but I will probably go with Dempsey at Camo centre forward in my MLS team that is just personally can do a good job in midfield but not really really a must have player for me so finally, we're just going to leave you with Inform Morales' it's positive and negative to look at. Now his price range is a 14 to 25k. I believe that's on both consoles as well. I would like to think he will get dropped to a discard price. Then he might be worth uh, picking up. Always worth picking up those discard informs as you're not going to be losing much. But for 14k with the uh, possible risk of losing 4k, uh, I think there is better non-inform options in the MLS for me, especially like Dempsey and Co. So hopefully you did enjoy this review. If you did, please leave a like. It does help out a lot. We're trying to grow as much as we can. We try to do the most in-depth reviews and scrub builders on YouTube. Please subscribe if you're new to the channel. Loads to check out on there. Loads more to come. So stay tuned for that. Thanks a lot for watching, lads. Cheers, lads. I do appreciate it. See you later.